Hello, this video is for The Breakfast Club. I happen to be a blind mother of three wonderful children. I don't get offended by much because I've been through way too much in my life to get offended by things. I've been, you know, through a lot. I lost my sight when I was 10. I've had a lot of life experience. I've always loved kids in general. It's my passion. That's why That's why I had started going to school for social work. But anyway, you don't need a life story. Because honestly, I'm really disappointed. I'm a blind mom. And I tear myself apart when it comes to a lot of things. And no, of course, I can't look at the camera right now, so maybe you find that funny. But I don't. I didn't find it funny when I lost my sight at 10. It was tragic. I remember colors. I remember my parents' faces. My dad, who's not here with me anymore, he's, he's, he passed in 2010. He put a lot of love in me, and try to teach me to love myself. I've always been so hard on myself because I've lost my sight. I still am to this day. And not because I lost my sight, I mean, I'm sorry, that doesn't make sense, but because I'm blind. I'm not with my kid's father anymore. We had a long-term relationship and we had three kids. My oldest is nearly 17. He's a awesome kid. And there's my daughter, who's nearly 12, and my eight-year-old son. Um, I take care of my kids just fine. How does a blind person take care of kids? Well, I can speak for myself. You know your kids before they come out of you. You learn their moves and everything. I'm not going to make this really long because it doesn't show right now, but I'm really upset. I've listened to your guys' show for a long time. And I have to honestly say that this show um, entertainment and social media can just be ugly sometimes, can it? I didn't find what you guys said funny. It lacked class. It was ignorant. And offensive, and I don't get offended easily, like I said earlier. You talk to any one of my children, and they'll tell you, I take care of them. I take care of them. I changed their diapers. I fed them. Stayed up with them at night. Knew when they were climbing on stuff before they could do it. They even get freaked out now, like, Mommy, how'd you know you I was doing that? Because, child, I've known you since you were in my belly. I know the moves you're going to make. Would I go walking around town and street with them and put them in danger? No. You know why? Because I have sense. I lost my sight, not my brain. Now, if I had a guide dog and my kids were old enough, yeah, I could walk around with them like that. There are ways. Because blind people have to survive, and yes, we have a right to have children too. Not saying that you said we didn't have a right, but you said who would leave their kids with a blind person? Well, anyone who knew me, anyone who knows me, pretty much, trust me with their babies. I took care of my own, and I took care of my nieces and nephews, my little cousins, and kids are my heart. I'm highly offended off of those comments and snickers and shit, things you guys thought was really, were really funny. There are a lot of people who are blind, who are incompetent, just like there's a lot of sighted people who are incompetent. And you really, <laughs> I don't know how to put this into words. I made a video earlier, but it, it came off as too angry. 
and that's just not me. It's not me anymore with anything. Entertainment is what it is. Social media is what it is. And it's honestly garbage and poison a lot of the time. There are good people, you know. Um, but the way you guys joked and everything the other day was disgusting. Lady E has nothing to do with this because she wasn't there. I don't know how she feels. Maybe she commented on it after, so maybe I shouldn't speak on it. But again, we are highly capable. I am capable. And I've done it. And I'll continue to do it. I have my YouTube channel where I cook. Um, but I don't need to prove anything to anyone. America today is very ignorant in so many ways, whether it's racism, discrimination, or just pure stupidity like your show the other day. It was crap. Talk to a competent, blind person. You know what I'm saying? Don't assume. Because you'll make an ass of yourself, and that's what you did the other day. I won't listen to your show anymore. I don't care how famous anyone is because I've never been starstruck by anyone. I even think Beyonce is awesome. We share the same birthday. But never have I been starstruck. I don't care who you are because you eat, sleep, and shit. Just like we all do, and guess what? Blind people also know how to wipe their asses and clean themselves. I'm sorry. I know that this doesn't sound very classy either. But when you talk about us not being able to take care of kids. It pisses me off. It's really offensive. And I think you guys do owe the blind community an apology, but we won't get it. And it's whatever. But what, what you said and how you handled the topic was uneducated. It was ignorant. And it was stupid. It was disgusting. I didn't choose to be blind. I didn't choose to lose my sight at 10. Can you imagine that? And then your whole entire life, you have to prove to people that you're worthy. I mean, even dating now, it's, it's like, fuck, I'm not good enough, right? Because I'm blind. All of a sudden, I'm an idiot or I'm just not normal? Well, who is normal? That shit's, I mean, your show the other day, that wasn't normal. That's not okay. It's unacceptable. Just like racism, discrimination, the same thing. It's all ignorant. It's all unnecessary and uncalled for and will get us nowhere. Might as well have been SpongeBob and Patrick speaking like that the other day. Nah, they have a little more sense than that. A little more compassion. That was really disappointing. It just was. This country, though. I'm disappointed in a lot lately. I really am. And my kids, they're everything to me. The biggest blessings in my life. Because things have been really, really hard lately. As I'm sure they have, whether you're blind or not. Because the world today kind of sucks. But there is beauty in it. And I'm trying to see that again. Ha ha, funny, right? I'm trying to see that. It's not all about sight, it's about insight, which you guys lack. No respect for you guys at all. Breakfast Club sucks. Charlemagne the God, all of you, you know what? It's a shame on you. And I know you don't care, but you know what? I don't either. Because you're nobody to me either. But people should use their platforms in a positive way to enlighten, to educate, and to inform. And to do, do, to do something real, not just talk shit or look a certain way. Or have a certain image. 
because I may not be able to see you, but I see through you. And that goes for anyone I meet. So, you can talk all you want to, but trust me, there are those of us that are confident. And we're way more capable than a lot of people you know. You know what I mean? I just got certified in telecommunications. But I would never be given the chance because of ignorance like this. I can probably work a spreadsheet and Excel program better than a sighted person can. We have to try two, three times as hard for everything in this world. I'm tired of it. I'm tired of it. Because of ignorance like that. But anyway, that's all I have to say. It's just... Shame on you, Breakfast Club, and all the ignorance that called in, and anyone else who has anything to say about it. I really don't care. <laughs>